Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me again, Quera, and also known as KKK TV on Facebook. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. For today's video, guys, it's just another daily vlog. Um, for today's video, guys, no, super stressed tayo ngayon, mga beshi. No? Hindi ko um, explain sa inyo kung gano tayo kay stress, as in super stress na stress tayo. Um, bumili kasi ako ng dishwasher, built-in dishwasher, noong Feb 28. Ang nangyari, nang, nangyari noon, Meron kaming old dishwasher nung unang-unang lumipat kami dito. Brand new yung bahay. And di namin siya nagamit. Di namin siya talaga nagamit. Ever since. And nung tinry namin siyang i-run test. I-test run nung, ano, tinang test tuloy. I-test run nung parang uh, nag-flood yung flooring namin parang a year ago. Uh, Nag-leak yung dishwasher. So, nag-leak siya sa baba. So, di namin alam kung, kung bakit siya nag-leak. Anyway, long story short. Mamili ako ng bag bagong dishwasher sa Canadian Appliance Source noong Feb 28. Ah, uh, nangyari kasi noon nag-phone ako sa sa Coast Appliance dito sa Calgary and they said out of stock yung gusto kong bilhin na dishwasher. Ayun kasi nag ayun kasi dishwasher na same color and ay yung same size na nagfi-fit na nagfi-fit sa dimension ng aking dishwasher area kanon. So, ayun. So, sabi nila, oh, we have that stock. So, I sabi ko, sige, push natin. Bilin ko siya right away. So, they asked for my credit card number. They asked for the pin code sa, la, sa likod ng credit card number. Uh, credit card. And then, the, uh, what do you call this? Expiry date. Ayun. So, we per I, I purchased it over the phone. And then, they sent me the receipt after. So, without even telling me kung ano ba yung uh, involved. Uh, kung baga, ba, ano ba yung... Uh, ano ba yung purchase agreement wala 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 sila sinabing gano wala kumbaga kumbaga para thank you for your purchase wala kumbaga wala as in wala kumbaga nagsend lang sila ng email afternoon hindi ko naman binasa yung email kasi nga para sa akin parang wala lang ganun parang for me it's if there's any defect or anything i can return the item right away di ba kumbaga parang right ko yun as a consumer anyway sabi nila sa akin they have this third party installer na they could recommend. So, ayun. So, uh, para nag-send sila ng link na sabi nila, ito yung gamitin mo kung gusto mo magpa-install. So, uh, nagbayad ako ng additional 300 plus dollars. So, yung, yung dishwasher pala is 600 plus dollars. Including tax na yun. Tapos, 300 plus dollars para sa installment. So, naka, naka almost 1K ako for the, ins for the installation and the removal of my old unit. And then the what they call this the dishwasher itself. Hi. So Feb 28 ko yun uh, pinurchase and then March 5 ko ako, March 5 ako nagpabuk ng installation. So the matin na yung technician na uh, ni recommend nila. So ayun the matin na technician ni nerebum nila yung old unit ko and then ininstall niya yung bago unit nila. Ang una naming red flag was There was water. No kinalak na lang hose na bago. There was actually water from the uh, from the u from the supposed to be new unit na binigay nila sa amin. And then the second thing was nung tinasra na namin ng unang una nagleak na agad yung unit. Tapos nung tinasra namin tinasra na namin siya ulit ng second and third time nagleak talaga siya. So binuk uh, Before the second uh, before the second run pala binuksan technician yung door miss ng mismong uh, uh, dishwasher and din nga nakita namin na doon talaga naglilik doon sa may door talaga ang ang defect talaga is nasa dishwasher so the technician told us na you could call the Canadian appliance source to get it replaced kasi nga parang din namin kasalanan yun di ba kumbaga they gave us a defective unit di ko alam kung scam ba siya or what So I called the I called Canadian appliance source right away and they said we cannot return the unit. So I was I was so surprised kasi nga di pa parang you guys gave us the a defective unit and we cannot return the unit. Parang bakit? Kumbaga parang where is the uh, 30 day guarantee kumbaga, di ba? Um they said we we have to call Whirlpool to book an appointment kasi nga Whirlpool yung tatak ng dishwasher. Um so ayun sa so, uh, sabi ko no uh, you, you have to give us um, what do you call this um, a refund so ang nangyari no March 5 binigyan nila ako ng parang link to kumbaga parang i-check nila kung pwede siyang i ibalik yung unit 
And then, nag tinype ko yung mga details, kung ano nangyari, nag ako ng pictures. And then, after a couple of days, March 7, nag-replace sila sa akin na hindi daw pwede ibalik yung unit. And, i kailangan talaga i-book yung unit sa Whirlpool para ipacheck. So, tumawag ako sa Canadian Appliance Source that same day, March 7. Sabi nila, hindi talaga pwede ibalik yung unit. I am not, uh, what do you call this? approve for refund as well for the installation and then for the unit kasi sabi ko sa kanila ibalik ko na lang yung pera ko kasi nga this is not this is you gave me a defective unit so bakit hindi ako bakit hindi ko pwede ibalik bakit hindi pa ibalik yung pera ko you get you can just grab your old defective unit i mean you could just grab your defective unit from my place wala akong problema doon kumbaga kunin niyo na yung defective unit yung ibalik niyo na yung pera ko lahat na nakuha niyo sa akin anyway so ngayon um, uh, binook nila ako ng appointment from, from Whirlpool and ang masakit sa loob ko is new unit siya and ito sira tapos alam mo yun ba? and as you guys know nagpapatay tayo ng bahay sa kabila and ang balak ko sana dito sa bahay na ito is ipagbenta siya and uh, pagandahin siya um uh, as much as possible, okay yung mga appliance na iwan ko sa bibili ng bahay. So, ayun. So, nai-stress talaga ako, best, no? Kasi nga, ito, naghihintay tayo ng technician from Whirlpool. And, ginagawa ko lahat. Nag-report nag na ako sa Business Bureau. Nag-report na ako sa Consumer Act. And, I already called my credit card if I could get, like, a, ref um, a dispute. Pero, uh, on the process pa yun. Um... Well, well, we'll see. We'll see kung ano mangyayari ngayon. Kasi, nas-stress na talaga ako sobra. But anyway, um, okay naman yung ating bahay. Ilalagay ko dito yung, ito, yung clip natin sa bahay. Ito, 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 ito. Hey guys, today is March 10th. This is the update on our house. Ang pisa kapitbahay. Grabe, ang bilis. Parang yung last update ko is parang few days lang. Ayan na siya. Ayan na siyang, what do you call that one? Foundation. Ayan na, yun ang pinaka-basement. Amoy grasa na hindi mo maintindihan. Tapos yun ang pinaka-garage natin. Hindi nyo ma-appreciate siya kung gano'n siya kalawak. Kasi nga, dito na yung view ko. Pero, malawak siya, besh. Malawak siya kung malawak. Ganyan siya, besh. Ayan, ayan na siya. Grabe. Ayan. So, ayan. Ayan po ang ating updates sa ating bahay ngayon. Meron na siyang, um, tawag dito. Ayan, meron na, siyang, meron na siyang parang semento sa gilid. Pero wala pa siyang buho sa floor. So, sabi ng uh, builder ko, by, by July, July, August. Kasi mabilis lang silang gumawa ng bahay dito, mga beshet. Kung baga, ang semento, ang semento lang talaga dito is yung basement, tsaka yung parang uh, base. Parang, parang pinaka-foundation nila dito. And then the rest is talagang plywood na. Uh, so, ayun. So, ayun ngayon, ang, ang ginagawa lang natin dito talaga dito is naghihintay tayo ng technician from Whirlpool para ipacheck kung talagang defective talaga yung unit. Eh, defective naman talaga yung unit ng mga beshi, no? Kung baga parang i-approve lang talaga nila kung defective yung unit. So, ngayon, ano ba ba i-approve? Kung defective, kung defective. Nag-live na ako ng Google review from uh, Tukas. And, hindi ko alam kung, ay, nag-reply sila sa akin sa Google review. Pero, hindi siya nag-reply sa akin sa Yahoo. Sa, email, sa mga email ko. And, to protect their, um, Siguro to protect their company, talaga nag-replace sila sa Google review, no? Nakakaloka. Yun lang. Naloka sila sa akin. Maloloka sila sa akin, mga beshi, no? Hindi nila ako hilo. Tiyos! Charot lang. Anyway, so, antay lang natin sila ng mga beshi, no? Kasi mahaba na itong intro na to, Kasi nagigigil talaga ako. Nagigigil si Kigil TV. Charot. Sige na. Antayin mo natin yung mong technician. Ito pala yung supposedly na bagong Bagong bago na sinasabi nila. Dishwashing. Na dishwashing. Oo. Ang ayaw ko pa dito, Daddy. Inano niya dito, oh. Kinapit niya dyan. Kinapit niya dito. Ba't niya kinapit? Sira na yan. Ayaw ko sa kanya. Parang mali-mali yung ginawa ng mga yan. 
kinapit niya doon, eh, eh, pareho naman ng sukat to, tsaka ng sukat na sa ano to, sa dati. Ako, ang dami ng tarpa. Ako, eh, paano ngayon yun? Kasi ito, tsaka yung lumatin dishwasher, pareho na pareho ng sukat yun. Pareho na kaya, kaya nga, kaya nga ay nabili. Ngayon, sin ngayon, sinira niya na to, oh. Wala na. Ang pangitig na niya sa bibili ng bagong bahay. Ito, oh. Doon niya, niya din real, oh. Tatakpan na natin. Ba't na pumayag naman na ipaan eh? Where to see the lake? So yun na nga Bers, hindi rin nila nagawa kasi sira talaga siya Bers. Kita nyo naman sa video, naglilik siya diba? Eh brand new. Supposed to be brand new siya. Pero naglilik siya. Ngayon, tatawagan natin yung... Whirlpool. Whirlpool nga ba? Sa so, school Whirlpool pa tatawagan natin. Oo. Sa cellphone niya, meron siya ngayon. Hindi, tawagan natin yung Canadian Appliance Source. Yan yung Whirlpool. Canadian Appliance Source. Yeah, Canadian. Appliance Source. Kaya natin yung CAS. Gera na yun naman to, Besh. Ah, just give me one second. It's Ryan. Uh, address. Thank you. Now sign it to phone number and the email address. Thank you. How may I help you today? So I purchased. I don't know, Bisham, if you're aware, but I purchased a built-in dishwasher on the 28th of Feb. And uh, from your third-party installer, it was installed on the 5th. And the dishwasher is faulty. It's broken. It's defective. It was leaking everywhere. So you guys refused a return. And you guys refused a yeah. return. You guys refused a refund as well. I tried to email you guys multiple times. I tried to call you multiple times. I begged for a refund. I begged for a return. And you guys disagreed. So you asked me to call Whirlpool to book an appointment. So they came today and they said it has to be returned. So um, I want you guys to, to call Whirlpool and get it all, uh, all um, 
arranged for me because I'm I'm not doing that because. So uh, Paul has already came and inspected your date. Just, they just left. Okay, so they will send us a report. So they have already left, so they will send us a report. Yeah, but and I am uh, I am selling my house, and this has to. This has to be, this has to go right away. So they have maybe like we need tax report, then uh, we will be able to know if we will be able to replace a new one for you. Okay, so we need that report first. Okay, so if you cannot re uh, replace it right away, I need the refund for the installation and then for this faulty unit because it's, it's giving me so anxiety since the 20th since the 5th that's why it's so a let's see the report first what whatever report is telling us what is the issue okay then we can give you an update okay because okay okay all right because because you are not giving me any replacement for this one I, I, i'm not getting it replaced because it will take time okay Okay, so uh, right now we're on to the issue, uh, we need that report, then we can see if we can give you a replacement, if you replace that. Alright. first we need that report. Alright, okay. Okay, bye. Thank you. Thank you, have Stress tab mga best. Tinatawag nyo pa naman yung Whirlpool, pero yung toll free nila is not very user friendly. Puro press 1, press 2, press 1, press 2. Scheduling ganyan, ganyan, pero wala akong makausap na totoong tao. Ayun ang mahirap ngayon eh. Tapos yung live chat naman nila, virtual assistant naman. So, kailangan ko na totoong tao, bes na makausap. Tari pa naman ako, bes. Matari ako kapag ginaganto mo ako. Mab mabuti akong kaibigan kapag... Mabuti talaga ako, mabait akong kaibigan. Mabait ako mabait. Pero kapag kinalaban mo ako, tari ako, bes. Anyway ba? Anyway mga bes, no? Ito po nagtatapos ang ating vlog for today. It's such a bad vlog na mga bash. Napaka bad vibe ng ating vlogs ngayon. Charot! Vlogs talaga, pero isa lang vlog. Pero anyway, so ingat-ingat lang tayo mga consumer no, sa mga gantong mga scam. Mga kaloka, ay ibalik ang ating datum. 1,000 din yun. Magkano din yun? 40,000 pesos. Mga kaloka! Itong dishwasher na to, ano to? Scam? Scam to? Hindi mo na mamagamit? May lilipat tayo ng bahay pag bebenta niya. Tingnan pa na tayo susko po. Ito naman. Ito. Ito na nang nagpapasaya sa akin. Ito mga anak ko. Inside. Hmm. Isa. Dalawa. O. Oh, tatlo. Sige. Pasok. Hmm. May mens. Puro dugo ang katang. Anyway. Bye bye muna mga guys. See you on my next vlog.